Hello guys, welcome to online web tutor presented by Perfect Solutions team. I am Sanjay. We are learning Vue.js tutorial for beginners in Hindi and this is our part 48. In this video session guys, we will discuss about URL parameters in route in Vue.js application. And also guys, if you are a beginner to this channel, then please don't forget to subscribe and keep watching our previous video sessions to get the clear concept about Vue.js tutorial. So basically guys, we have done previous video session means video number 47 mein, humne sare blocks ki listing kari thi, humne so blocks page pe, okay? And basically we have created a route, if I inspect this, so now we have a route something called blog hyphen sorry forward slash and this is blog id, okay? Again if I just inspect this item, so now here we have blog forward slash and blog id. Okay, so single block of reach करने वाले हैं. Basically, अगर मैं click करूँ, so right now there is nothing. यहाँ पर कुछ नहीं है, because we have not coded for single block. Okay, again go to show all blocks. Again I click and nothing appears. So if I go to fake JSON REST API, so single block को fetch करने के लिए, guys, अगर हमने all blocks को fetch करना हो, basically we have to call this URL by get method. Okay, so अगर single block को read करना हो, suppose this 96. So just use this URL and now we have to pass a parameter of ID something called 96 and this is the 96 post ID details okay so we use this concept ko use karne wale hai. so just back to editor so basically guys ye hai wo component jahan par humne sare blocks ke content ko render kiya hua hai okay so basically let's make a separate component for reading a single blog so let's say single blog dot view just go to show blog, copy all these contents and now paste inside this single blog. Okay, save this file. Or basically guys, ye hogi hamare single blog read karne ke liye. Okay, so let's see that. Single blog. Okay, just get rid of this v4. v4 remove kar dunga and now also we have to remove the router link. Okay, my router link remove kar dunga. So just get rid of all these. Okay, only blog title and blog body. Okay, so basically, here we have to define instead of blocks, we have to make a uh, object something called blog. Okay, ye o blog object hogi guys, jahan par hum single response store karne wale hain. And basically, this is a object. Okay, to humne ek object define kiya hua hai. Now, ab is object ke gandar under guys, humne values store karni hai. Okay, so basically. We are going to read ID parameter from URL. Means, जब भी हम किसी block पे click करेंगे, if I go here, if I click on any block item, click करते ही guys, हमें इसकी ID parameters read करना है by the help of this URL route. Okay? अगर मैं जाऊँ slides पे, basically, here is the ID and here is the parameter. 12 is the parameter in URL. Okay? So, basically, हमें इस parameter को read करना है. So, just back to editor. So, basically, to read that, let's say that, ID and basically here we have to store called this dot route dot params at dot here we have to specify the parameter name so right now abhi tak humne koi bhi route create nahi kiya hua hai okay so just go to route dot js and let's import the component of for single block so let's say that single block Okay, and this is inside views folder. So single block dot view. Now we make route create. करने वाले so just copy and paste. Let's say block, and here is something we have to pass the ID. Okay, block, and this is the ID. Okay, something URL we have block for slash and block ID. Just back to editor. So this is called the single block. Okay, so basically we have to retrieve ID. हमें ID ID parameter retrieve करनी है. Okay, so just back to single block, and let's say that this route params dot ID. This is the ID guys that we have specified right here. Okay, अगर आप जो भी नाम यहाँ दोगे guys, you had need to specify right here. Okay, so by the help of this ID, we are going to create a HTTP GET request to get the single individual post details. Okay, so forward slash and basically we have to make URL something like this post and here is something called post ID. Okay, so concatenate with the value called this dot ID. Basically, this dot ID refers to the object that we have created right here inside this data object. Okay, ye hai wo ID and basically this ID actually we are getting from URL. Okay, so just save this file and now we are getting response here. So if I just get rid of all these, let's say console.log. 
that's a response so if I save this file save this file also so just go to browser and now we have an error so go to console and something like that we have to comma separator rakhni hai properties ko. so just back to editor and now here we have to specify a comma okay so just save this file so basically agar main click karo is pe, so now here we have details of our post id 1 okay again go to show blog click on this and now we have details of post id 2 okay so hume is a read karna hai, individual response ko read karna hai on our single block component okay so just back to editor so now here we have to store all the results inside this blog okay so let's say that this dot blog equal to let's say response dot body okay because sorry response guys hamare is response ke under body parameters ke store hai okay so we have to read all the details from his body parameter so after getting all the details from body we have to store inside this blog object that we have created and now uske baad guys hume is blog object ko read karna so this is called blog title and now this is blog.body okay so if i save this file go to browser and now this is all about single blog again go to show blog again i'm clicking on this and now these are the details so ye thi basically guys ki humne so block page pe sare blocks ki listing ki uske baad humne individual block ko url parameter ke through read kiya okay so apne url topics ke andar guys humne kafi kuch discussion kiya hua hai view js playlist mein something called ki hum kaise tabs banaye kaise hum components ko render kare sath hi sath kaise url ke through parameters ko read kare aur bhi kafi kuch humne discussion kiya hua hai apne routing playlist mein okay so if you go to editor so these are the things guys that actually we have studied in url routing in vue.js application agar suppose guys agar humne do se jyada parameters agar main url mein send kiya hua so basically by the help of this id aur ye id guys hum yahan se retrieve kar rahe hain so first of all we have to make a route means a path by the help of this path actually we can get details of that value inside our url parameters right here so I think guys that I have made much more clear concept about routes in Vue.js application. So if you have any doubt in this video session guys then please drop your comment. I will give my reply as soon as possible. So for this video session guys thank you for watching. Have a great day.